Peter O'Bad, you're watching a great docu-series, but that's gonna have to wait because Decades is happening. Hello, Irish, happy Thursday. Hi, Ruru. Hi, uh, Nets, Nets, first off, sorry if I said that incorrectly. Thank you about my hair, I got it cut yesterday. Rachel, howdy. I did get a haircut, I got it recolored yesterday, which the color is pretty much the same. I got it lighter, so it's supposed to fade more lavender. So fingers crossed that that happens. Cinder Snap for us, hello. Kodo, hi. Caitlin, hi. Thank you guys. Arcadia Nova, hello. First time catching the stream. Exciting, just finished the other two episodes. Super exciting. I'm glad you guys, I don't know if you watched it on YouTube or on the Twitch replay, but hopefully putting it on YouTube will help more people find it and then I love it when you guys can come live that's so fun so yeah so my hair used to be short of course like haircuts go it's like slightly shorter than it was supposed to be because that always happens but it'll I like it when it's a little just a tad longer but it's hair so it grows so that's good thank you Rachel spicy nudes hi hello thank you thank you thank you thank you drill sergeant quackers happy Thursday welcome in all right, how are you guys doing? Are you are you guys having a good week? I am kind of ah Rose. Rose, that was a grand entrance. Happy four month, Rose. Welcome in. The uploading on YouTube definitely helps. Not on Twitch often. Well, that's really good to hear, Arcadian. I love that was busy sorting the CC stuff. Thank you so much, you guys are amazing. So you guys, Irish and DSIMS and Rose are going to be, they volunteered, they're so amazing, are gonna be organizing the custom content and mods in Discord into like specific categories for like the time periods and stuff like that since we mostly do a lot of decade stuff and they are absolutely amazing. DSIMS, you and Rose are four months together, woo. Happy four months, D Sims. I can't believe you guys are tracking right there together. I guess you guys came in right around the same time. Um, I have to pee real bad. Last time you got your hair cut, you said an inch and then she did it and was sinking. Oh my God, an inch is much more than you imagined. <laughs> yeah, she did like the first rough cut and that's kind of where I wanted it. And then it went, by the time I curl it, it gets a little shorter, but anyways, Anyways, you're okay, Kodo, Gina. Hi, welcome in. Hold on, you guys, my contacts, do, do any of you guys wear contacts and sometimes they go blurry? That happens to me sometimes when I'm reading chat and I'm like, I start to freak out and I'm like, oh my God, I can't see, I can't see you. That's what's happening to me right now. But anyways, um, thank you, D Sims. D Sims, it, Rose, you and D Sims held hands as you guys entered the door together. I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Um, Sim, I can't, I can't see you guys. I can't see your names. You found me on YouTube, played, uh, the first one. Just watch the second one. Well, welcome. We're going to play live tonight together then. I'm doing okay, Kodo. I'm busy. So for work, I talked about it before. So I work for an online business coach full time during the week. And part of like a, a common thing in the online business space is like doing launches for their different, like she coach has like coaching programs. And so we're like in middle of like a launch is happening next week and like I have to create a lot of content for her for that and do a lot of like project management and stuff. So I've been really busy this week. So, and then having my haircut yesterday took time out of work. So my brain is a little bit tired. So if I'm a little bit blah and my brain doesn't work tonight, that's why, because my brain is a little bit fizzled. Um, but anyways, let's go ahead and hop in because I am ready to play. Let's play some Sims. And I have something, I have someone actually, let's see, I have someone to introduce you all to. So let's go. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I thought we would start off today with our oopsie baby. <laughs> our little baby that, uh, William doesn't know about yet. <laughs> but I went in and I did all like, cause it was a baby girl, but we wanted it to be a baby boy for storytelling. So I went in and so Stella 
had a baby boy. I named him James, but I don't know. I'm open to if you guys like want a different name. I just kind of went through, I like looked up like 1850s names. And so we've got to chat about what we think. Is it? He's so cute. He's cute. And what's fun. Okay. He looks just like Stella. He got Stella's blonde hair and he got Stella's brown eyes. So James is a, yeah, I think James is good. It's like a nice, solid, like strong name. I think it, I really like it. Cause I was like, you know, if his name's going to be James Westbrook, that sounds really good. Right now he's actually James Ewing. Because if you guys did see last stream, I know most of you were here live. A lot of, some of you guys have watched the replays. Um, Stella married Joe, our friend, the bartender. And uh, I'm going to hop into the, the family tree real quick, which is always very hard to see on screen. But because um, it doesn't let you zoom in, which is really annoying. Is there a mod that like lets you zoom into the family tree? Well, Stella married Joe while we were making our way to the Wild West. And we were like, oh, Joe, he's a stand up guy. You know, Stella got pregnant. And Williams know where, where do we found. So Joe stepped in and married him. So from a storytelling, we can decide, does Joe know that James is not his kid? Or did Stella convince him, to, like, like, did Stella seduce Joe, get married very quickly and make Joe think that James is his kid? <laughs> we, can, we don't have to decide now, but we could go either way with that story down the line. So for right now, I gave him Joe's last name of Ewing. So even if it's the family trying to cover up the that it's William's baby, either way, it is, if you click on James, though, it does show that William is, in fact, the father. So <laughs> there he's living here with um, what he doesn't know <laughs> doesn't hurt him. They definitely covered that stuff up back then a lot. I'm sure they really did. Yeah, for real. Because um, are we going to have a full blonde family like our family from Ultimate Decades? I don't know because William has brown hair. And then depending on who he does end up actually marrying in the Wild West town, um, which I always want to marry someone with red hair because it's my favorite. But look at him. He's such a cutie. I think Stella's very happy. She sort of, you know, as happy as she could be given the, given the, uh, <laughs> you think he knows that you like him being a stand-up guy. Yeah. So maybe, so Joe knows, cause like Joe's like best friends with us. We're really best friends with his little brother, John. But, um, so I thought we would just start off Aww. getting to know, um, I don't want to let the clock run too much cause I want to switch us back to William, but I wanted us to meet James. Um, yeah. So she actually moved herself in. So this was the lot. I ended up adding a second floor because there's actually two families living in this house and I just left it that way because there's not a lot of extra lots in this world to move them into. So here's stand-up guy Joe, our stand-up, he's bartender, but um, basically John married Evelyn, which was the original love interest that I had for us to leave in town, but they got married and they also had a baby. So they had a baby and the game named her Tessa. And I thought that was like the cutest thing ever. I don't know if it's really like an old name or not, but it was so cute. So they had a little girl named Tessa. So basically John and Evelyn and Tessa live here and then Joe and Stella. And I just added a second floor so there would be enough room for everyone. So this is where they live here in Brindleton Bay. So it's so good. Zero's historical mod sword fight with real swords. I haven't used that one. Well, is that the one that I... I do one with swords and sword fighting in my Ultimate Decades Challenge, but I can't remember if it's the Zero one or not. It probably is, honestly. Okay, well, we're going to leave these guys. Are they going to fall like fall in love after marrying to avoid the scandal? Or was Stella always long for her runaway cowboy? Ooh, I wonder... Yeah, we can go so many ways with the story. We're not going to do death rolls for James either. We're going to like let him just keep growing up because I want him around for um, he he's going to be our backup one if all of our children die. But two, we need him for the story later, depending on where the story goes. 
Rose, with the new pack, we can turn this into a multi-level family lot. We totally could. We totally could. And I want to do some remodeling because this was just one that came with the, um, save the, uh, what's it called? Antiquated Brindleton save. So I want to make it kind of fit them a little bit better. But anyways, let's get in to, let me hit save just in case nothing goes wonky. Let's switch back to William because he did get his lot at the end of last stream. And I want to start, you know, building our building ourselves up because we have like no money. You've already got James and Tessa paired up in your head. Well, they're cousins. They're cousins. So I thought about that too, and I was like, oh wait, they're cousins because they're bre they're brothers. They're the, like two brothers have those kids. Um, one and I eighty six are founder on the first episode. We definitely need a backup for sure. D, you made it. I hope your headache is feeling better. Let's switch over. Okay, I'm probably missing some chats, and I apologize because one one of my contacts is still all blurry, and I've been noticing I'm starting to miss more chats. So I'm trying to do, trying to balance playing and keeping up. Okay, where do we live again? Down here, William. Love that the first ladies we have both ended up with the best friends in one house. They do. And then I like, I couldn't, I didn't have time to like figure out all of the stuff with them, like marrying and having kids with um, MC Command Center. But what I realized was as long as they were marked as a play, played household, it's not marrying them off. So I just marked everyone as played household that I didn't want crazy stuff happening to them. Um... Yeah, we need to get to making money. That's going to be our main focus today, at least at the start, is going to be making money. So first, we're actually going to start off in build mode just to get a couple of things. Mainly right now, I'm just going to get a couple things down for the horse. Um, yeah, so we're basically going to put, I think just to literally start, we're going to put a tent, like Rose just said, a tent, a pea bush, a, um, a grill, and like a thing to feed the horse. Um, so let me just start with the horse because that stuff I don't think costs a lot. And I'm not going to, we'll make it really pretty, we'll make it pretty later. But just to get started, we'll just get everything down on the lot. Where is the, I want the custom content one that I have, this one. Maybe we can just put the horse stuff. What size is this lot? 40 by 30. Okay, so we're going to have a lot of room to like build a barn eventually. But it's like he just bought this like empty lot of land. Just get a prairie grass patch. Okay, I can do that. That was 50 simoleons. Yeah, it's summer too, so it should grow. We can just put like, yeah, that's only five simoleons. Let's just put like a couple little, or I could even do the, I could put the trait on too. Um, is it a, I should, I want to turn simple living on. Well, that, that we're, go, we're about to go to the um, general store and buy some stuff to start our garden. So the way I wrote my rules is we can start our garden immediately. Where the heck it is prairie, wild prairie grass. It is under challenges. Yeah, there it is. It's at the bottom. Okay. So I put a couple, but I want wild ones to grow too. We'll just put two, save our five small ants. Okay. We'll do that. I'm going to put simple living. I'm not, I never use, um, oh wait, that's challenge as well. I never turn off the grid on because it messes with the stoves and you like can't cook a lot of recipes and that really annoys me. So I never actually use, I just pretend like we're off the grid. Okay. So, oh, there'll be prairie grass just off. Oh, is there prairie grass off the lot in this world? Um, okay, that's it for lot challenges, simple living, um, a tent, I have like a custom content one that I think will look good for the occasion, if I can find it. Uh, oh my god, we should do a TP. <laughs> Where? I thought I had, I swear to God, I thought I had a custom content one. I'd seen it before, but now I don't.
Okay, we might end up just starting with our sleeping bag. Unless I give us a TP. <laughs> a ball out on the lot too. I'm really sad. When I like look to play test this, I swore I had a tent, but I don't. And I'm not going to use one of the not old timey looking ones. Okay. So. I don't know. 60 small hands, we can maybe just do a really small, oh, nope. Nope. We need to get a little bit more money before we build a structure. Because I do want to have a structure so we can get the um, tiny house residential. What am I thinking about? Eight, uh, about the new pack, the, the rent, um, for rent or whatever the heck it's called. <laughs> If that's the one you're talking about, I'm really excited for it. Let me get the ball roast before I forget. Um, not kids, pets. Okay, here's the ball. Ugh, I'm really sad about the tent situation. Um, pea bush right here. Oh, I have the pea anywhere mod too though. So I don't even really need to spend money on the bush. Um, so we won't do that. And we have a fire, what do you call it? Camp, camp, I don't know, a fire in our inventory. Okay, I'm gonna leave it at that. And then we still have the whole day. So we can come back and add stuff. Um, Cause we have in our inventory, we have this, a couple of things of food. We're starting super rags to riches. Okay, we'll come back. We can add whatever we need. But for right now, we're gonna go to Hooper's. Oh yeah, a chair, a table, and a wash basin, for sure. So I guess then, if that's the case, I need to make sure we're gonna have enough money. I didn't even think about that. I haven't done like like this hardcore rags to riches in a long time. Okay. Then maybe what I'll do is the little apple crate thing. This thing. Maybe we'll say we found one of these. And I can put that Oh, actually, no. I forgot I have this sink that has like, this looks like he's got, we're going down to the river to get water. That'll be our sink. I don't think we need a chair and a table. That seems luxurious. Oh yeah, where's that modern truck over there? We'll cover it with the rock. See if I can. Did I cover it all the way? Almost. <laughs> Problem solved. No more automobiles. I don't mind if he stands to eat. I'd rather save the money. I'd rather save the money. I'll put like a log for him to sit but I'm not gonna get a table. I wanna do stuff that looks like he could have actually just like grabbed it. I'm not gonna connect it to the fire though cause this thing tends to... Okay, so to start we'll just cook whatever we can make on the campsite. Um, bye bye Felicia, no more cars. Uh, we can pee anywhere with the mod. The horse can eat, the horse can play. Does the horse need water? I haven't quite figured that out yet if they like actually 
Oh, we should have brought his guitar from the house. Dang it. I wish I would have done that. But I think the horse does need... No water? They don't really need it? Okay. I didn't think they did. I didn't... It's kind of like... Um, activities, creativity... Guitar. Where... Oh my god, a guitar is 600 simoleons? Nope, we can't do that yet. He's going to have to just wait. We're going to have to... Um, just to start, I think I'm going to do the garden in the ground, and then I'll move it to the garden plots. How much are they? How much are... They're 10 simoleons each. I feel like... Oh my god, yeah. Like I'd rather save as much as we can so we can get a woodworking bench ASAP. Because I think I want to have an, a woodworking bench before we start building stuff. So hopefully he has to rough it like this only one or two days. We'll get the garden planet. So now let me look on the spreadsheet. So we're in summer day. What day? Why well, won't it show me what? I'm like trying to hover over it. It won't show me. Um, okay, summer, we can plant a bunch of stuff. Yeah, let me look at the calendar. I don't know why the thing hovering won't show me. I hate this thing all showing me so much stuff. Okay, we're in day three. I have seven day seasons on for the moment, but we can turn 14. We might turn 14 on just to give us... Let's go to the general store. So we haven't like hardly done anything yet. Wax to Witches Wild West Edition, exactly. Yeah, I like I'm trying to play this more like storyline based and like realism based. So like I would really like him to have to have look, y'all, I added some outfits so we can actually buy some clothes too. <laughs> Um, let's see, can we, I might need to bring, I don't think we've met the Hoopers yet. I forgot to set everything for sale because I forgot. <laughs> I could cheat the guitar and just say he brought it from home if I want, but also like the idea of making one on the woodworking bench. I never use one on the woodworking bench. Okay, season... Summer basil, bell pepper, black bean. Green beans make a lot of money, but I think I forgot to set them. I don't even. Yeah, I forgot to set them for sale. Hold on. Dang it, I'm so mad at myself. We like play tested and everything, and then I um I fudged this a little bit. I gotta teleport. Harold. We'll just fix it real quick. And then we'll be good to go. And then, so anyone who wasn't here when we built this lot, what I had to do was basically I made a retail lot and this nice gentleman here is Harold Hooper and him and his wife own it and run it and as long as he sets everything for sale and uh, we can actually come in here at any time and buy stuff. Let me see if I control him, if it'll let me do it, but I might have to go into his household. Yeah, we're gonna have to go. If anybody needs a break or a drink or a stretch or anything, now's a good time <laughs> because I'm just gonna have to set stuff for sale real quick. I love Harold so much too. Okay, Harold. My dummy self didn't do this because I was like, do it after stream. And I forgot. 
It really doesn't have to be everything. It could just be the, I'm just doing this summer stuff. What else is summer? Um, bell peppers. Okay, I did do those. I think I did the top row and I forgot to do everything else. Tomatoes, I did those. Strawberries. I kind of tried to set these shelves up based on the season to help me remember. Tomato, strawberry, parsley. I'll just do the front one because we're not buying that many of them. We're going to just plant. Set for sale. Oh my God, is there some, is Harold Hooper actually from Sesame Street? I didn't even know that. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna run the ad now because it's about to run in a minute and I'm gonna do it while I'm doing this. Okay, which doesn't apply to most of you guys, but okay. We don't need carrots because we already have some and I don't think they're in season, they're springing. Spring and fall, onions, apples will be fall too, but I'm doing it now because I'll forget and we'll come back for, we'll come back for fall and I'll be like, dang it. Okay, grapes. We should get into nectar making. Maybe we can do that for some cash at some point, not right away, because I don't even know how much the nectar the thing lasts. Uh, which retail mod are you talking about? Because if it's one of the Little Miss Sam ones, um, I do have that one, but it didn't function for the way that I needed it to function in this in this particular save file. Okay. We're ready to go. Okay. I know I didn't do all three rows of everything. I already did all the sugar and stuff. Yeah, all this. Rose, you just gifted two subs. One, two, I don't know how to say your name. Nets for song and Kodo, awesome. Oh, Carl's, do you think? Okay, I'll have to look into it because this actually works really well. Oh my gosh, Rose. <laughs> gifted another sub to Arcadia Nova. Rose, you are so incredibly generous. You guys enjoy your gifted subs from Rose and make sure to say thank you. Okay, let's switch back. We're ready to go. Sorry about that slight intermission. <laughs> Do -do -do -do. Did William go back home? William? We have a go similar. There was a ghost in the people panel. No, 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 no. Not Mrs. Hooper. Was If the ghost was Mrs. Hooper, I have to find a way to revive her. Mrs. Hooper cannot be already gone. Oh no. Is it Mrs. Hooper? I don't know, I can't tell just based on this. Yeah, I'm gonna have to make, I definitely think I'm gonna make them immortal. Cause right now I have everyone set as played households. And so aging is on for everyone. And I don't want that to be the case. Cause one, I don't have to remake a hundred townies. I don't know how to flag them as immortal. I don't know if um, Harold is still here. I don't think anyone is here. Oh, there he is. You just saw it in William's panel? I'm like, I 
Where's the ghost? Now I'm like, I need to know. Hello. Welcome to Hooper's General Store. High quality, low prices. <laughs> we need to get... Yeah, I want to kind of get a little bit of a relationship with him. Oh, I do. Krista, you are so right. I do have them set as adults that look old because we very specifically didn't want them to die right away. I don't think she's died. I don't think she, I don't think she has. I don't know who. Look, Nanny Bell is here. I love it. Now the townies are showing up. Here, let's introduce ourselves to Isabella. Isabel, Isabel, not Isabella. I call her Nanny Bell. Howdy. Okay, we've already met the, we've already met the sheriff. Everyone wants to talk to the new guy in town. Okay, hold on. Pause. I want to learn how to make a sim immortal. MCC, sim flags, MC command center flag as immortal. Can I click on him and do it? MC Command Center. Hold on. Sim flag. See, I never use the flagging system. <gasps> Flag as immortal. Yes. Harold, I've got you, buddy. You will never die, not as long as I'm in charge. Okay. Could be some interesting lore about the never dying sh shopkeepers that are the heart of the community. I love it so much. Okay. I don't need to talk to any of these. We can, have we met? Here. This is one of the love interests. This spicy new, do you made Eden, I think. But we met her at the general store if things take off with her. Look, everyone is very interested in who is this new guy? Now I can copy the flag to another sim. Oh, that's so cool. I need to hook her up with Steven so no one can take her. Steven's, I mean, Steven. Okay, William, we got to do some shopping. We got, we've got to make money. So I love that all the town folk are here. But we need to get some green peas, green beans or whatever the heck those are. And... And I lost my spreadsheet. Nope, not screenshots. Y'all don't need that. Okay. Is that green beans? Yeah, we got green bean. We need lemon. Tomato for sure. I gotta keep an eye on money. I have this set to auto restock, but where is where did Mr. Hooper go? He's back in the back. I don't know where he went. Well, I guess the store is open or people wouldn't be here. Uh, Blackberry. Oops, I missed those. Strawberry. I went too quick. I forgot to put those for sale. Strawberry will be good. Stop talking, William. Purchase your... Epic Nurse, welcome in! Um, some of the sims were created by people in the community, so technically I guess they're on the gallery, but I don't know, D-Sims, are you okay with like other people downloading your sims if they're on the gallery just for their own gameplay? I'll let that up to, be up to you guys who created them. And then my sims, I need to get up on the gallery, the ones that I created. Oh no, your internet went poof. Okay, we got a strawberry, a green bean, a room, parsley... And bell pepper. Okay, that'll get us started. We still have 585 simoleons. How did things go with him introducing himself to? But we'll come back. We don't have time for love interest at the moment. Love, I gotta focus. One track mine. 
how did he like grab his produce close to her? He's like, people, I am trying to shop here. He is. I'm like, we've got to, we've got to make money, guys. We'll be back to chat up the town. Maybe we'll go to the saloon in the evening, but we've got limited daylight and we've got to get our garden planted. If we're going to survive this town. Wait, why are you tense? Festering bitterness. I think that's from being near the banker. That's who he's got the bad relationship with. Why is our energy? Oh, I forgot I didn't really let him sleep very much last night and we were up really late. Decent sharing is caring. They are for everyone to use and enjoy. All I ask is people don't claim them as their own, but they can do whatever they want with them in their game. That makes complete sense. Of course, obviously, anytime you guys, you know, use something from someone online, obviously don't claim it as your own. And then if I make changes to them, I always just point out like so-and-so made this. Like usually it's builds, not sims for me, but I'll be like so-and-so created this, but I like changed it for X, Y, Z or whatever. Okay, we're just gonna, we're not gonna do garden plots. We're just gonna put them randomly, which I, is not my preferred way to do a garden. But for right now, that is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna keep a couple of these strawberries in case we need a snack. Because those we brought with us. Wait, carrots are not in season, so we'll keep those for food. Here, start planting. Hey, whiskey! And the green bean. Oh, good, he likes gardening. <laughs> we love that. Excellent, that'll get you far, because we're gonna need to garden. I like that he actually kept them all in a row because usually they end up all like random all over the place. Okay, hopefully some of these will be harvestable tomorrow, but most of them probably won't be harvestable till the, the following day. But we still got 585. Something about a bookshelf and a child. Okay, not sure. Um, we're gonna need a nap though, to be quite honest. We're about to pass out. Hey, Whiskey. How are your needs, buddy? You're looking great. You're looking excellent. What do you think about our new land, buddy? We're gonna build you a barn one day. Okay, let's go have a nap. We're just gonna have a nap in middle of the middle of the afternoon. No big deal. Welcome wagon. Boy, this town is way too friendly. Oh no, I didn't mean to exit the I didn't mean to do that. They're gonna be they're gonna be they're not gonna like us anymore. I thought about that too, D Sims. Willie does need a scar. Um there's I was thinking we should add one from his um, dang it, I totally, I was meaning to, um, wake him up, not cancel the welcome wagon. Ah, now they're gonna be mad at us. Okay, it's only slightly red. What is that buzzing sound? Are there bugs out here? You like this? Um, uh, what is it? Oh, that's like really sweet. What is it? What is it, passion fruit lemonade? Anybody like passion fruit lemonade from Starbucks? I'll drink it. Can you like put some water in it to like dilute it a little bit? <laughs> That's like sweet. Okay, William, come on. William needed his beauty sleep. I know we could have got some free food. Okay, look, watch this. I've got this mod where they can literally pee anywhere. It's like so crazy. <laughs> I wonder if you, uh, I've never tried it either until right now. It was really sweet. All right, William, we're going to need some food. Thank you. Do you not like it? Okay. We're going to need food, but we have, we're pretty good on money. So maybe we could, I'm trying to think. Oh, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to the saloon. We're going to grab us a bite. Something cheap. 
and we're going to gamble. <laughs> we're going to try. We'll play one round and see, because if we win, if we lose, we don't lose that much. But if we win, we get a couple hundred simoleons. So we're going to try it. We're going to try. Should have had a tree so it looked like he was marking the tree. I know, I hate how like empty our lot is at the moment, but it's so rewarding once it's not empty and it all starts to come together. I'm gonna have to control Rusty to work the bar though. All right, Rusty, go tin the bar so we can get us some food. And we haven't really had a lot of action with Fannie Mae, so I hope she's here, because we haven't really gotten to chat to her too much. Hey, Rusty! Order... Wait, why? Why can't we order food? Well, we can grab some ships. You like the pumpkin uh, chai? My favorite drink in the world is dirty chai. So like a chai, chai tea with a shot of espresso. Mm, that's my favorite drink ever. Okay, get some chips and then we'll see who's showing up so we can do... Um, I love that the girls are dancing. Here, you girls put on your outfits. I'm getting really nervous at this screen right now because we haven't saved in a while and this is not looking good. Why when I just went into MC Command Center, it's not opening? I'm gonna give it a second. I'm gonna be really, really, really sad. MCC froze. Do I have to save and exit and open it back up? Okay. Let's just do that. We'll just restart it. Okay, let's just do a quick BRB. It's not gonna take that long, but sometimes my loading screen takes a, um, takes a minute. So let's just do a real quick break and then I'll have it all loaded back up. It will be right back. But I'm glad we were able to save because that would have stressed me out. Okay, BRB.
Okay, it's back. My loading screen just took a minute. Oh, that made me nervous. I was like, no, I'm so glad you guys knew how to save. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We will not be MC Command Center dressing the saloon girls, unfortunately, because I'm not gonna try that again. But Dee, I'm actually glad you asked about the bar because I forget a lot of you guys were not here when we built the lot. So before we get back into play, um, Basically, this is the Eight Bell Saloon. Rose had built this for Strangerville, but it fits so perfectly in this world that we put it in to this one and we just left the name the same. And the owner is Rusty Bell. Yes, his name is Rusty Bell. And that's this guy right here. So he owns the saloon. And I have this set up as a live-in bar with um, Little Miss Sam's mod. And so him and the three saloon girls which are Fannie Mae in the yellow, Tallulah, which is, she's looking, can't really see her. They look stunning in their actual outfits. I'll have them, I'll ask them to change their outfits in a little bit instead of using MC Command Center. And then this one is Shania Twain. Yes, her name is Shania Twain. So those are the three saloon girls. So they all live on this lot and it's a live-in bar. So as long as we control Rusty, we can make him tend the bar and everything. So that is the townies that are related to this lot and how is William doing we're just a little tired I want to do poker if other okay good the bankers here so banker always wins if he wins again let's wait till one more let's go ask the girls to here go introduce yourself to Fannie Mae I want to see how they're going to interact. Yeah, Shania is the good girl. And then Fannie Mae and Tallulah are a little wild. Fannie Mae being the wildest. What's he doing? Okay, they're goofing around. Why are you always starting rumors? Let's get to know. She's materialistic. Fannie Mae, it's so funny. All of the girls swoon over William, but Fannie Mae is just kind of like, eh, he's just another guy. She did not swoon over us, and that's going to make him... Is that going to make him feel some type of way? Like he's going to try to get her because she did not... She she was not impressed. She was not D-Sims. Did you see that? You guys have seen like the other saloon girl in the other world was like all over him. I want to reset these guys to get them off the table so we can. Here, we'll just play with, let's see, Boss Hog, Rusty. Yes, and the Sheriff. That's who we played with last time too. Come on, Rusty. We need money. Oh, yes. Oh. Uh-huh. Let's get some gambling in, and then it's 8 p.m. Come on. Oh, yeah, it's true that Free Love was also on. But when but when we were in Strangerville, the, that uh, Annabelle Sweet wanted to ask him on a date, and Free Love wasn't on in that town. Okay. He's sitting in the chair where everyone kept winning the other day. So if we don't win today... You thought Shania would be unimpressed? The real Sonia Twain song that don't impress me much. That is so true. I really like Fannie Mae. What are the girls doing? I love that Fannie Mae is just dancing. And there's no music. I've been trying to find a good like saloon song to play whenever they're like dancing and stuff, but I haven't been able to find a good one that's like copyright free so far yet. Um, the best one I found was the one that I used for the trailer. Becca, you just got here and we just, this is the first time we're gambling, I promise. We're just trying to see if we can earn a little money for the night. <laughs> we're only going to play one round. But he's sitting in the winner's chair because everyone who sat in that chair yesterday won. But I think the banker and the sheriff are cheating. 
Come on, William. No, the sheriff won again! Okay, we're not playing another round. We're not playing again. I'm resetting you so you don't play again. Okay, I think... Is there anyone else I want to meet? I think we've introduced ourselves to mostly everyone that's here. But we're tired, so we... The sheriff and the boss cheat by passing cards under the table. They do, and I think they split the earnings. I think they do. They're definitely cheating. We want a lot more with our friends back at home. He's in a... It's, it's actually... I like that, though, for storytelling, that he's not winning when we first got get here, though, because it's kind of like he was like... Uh, he... What, what am I trying to say? Like, when he was playing with the guys at home, like, that was just his buddies. But now he's, like, in a Wild West town with people who, like, really know how to gamble. And he's realizing he's not quite as good as he thought he was. <laughs> I haven't tried the cheating option yet because I've been scared, like, what the repercussions are going to be for it. But um, let me make sure Whiskey's not hungry. I don't know why sometimes, too, when you try to click on the horse, it doesn't show me. There it goes. Okay, he's he's good. So we're just going to go to sleep in our tent under the stars. Hopefully get a full night's sleep. Hopefully, maybe something will... I don't think anything's going to be ready to harvest yet in that garden. We'll see how it goes. I know, I'm scared. What if we do get beat up? He's already got beat up once okay we're super hungry here come like clean up a little bit it would make good gameplay though or jailed oh my god what if we did get what if the we, i think we would have to And then we've got a couple of produce left that we can have a snack. Oh man, that water really made it. Oh, we're going to need a trash can. We're going to definitely need a trash can. Um, let's just have the strawberry. That helped a little bit, not very much. We'll use the bathroom. Anything we can harvest yet? Oh my god, yes, we can harvest. Here, we'll plant a couple more. Let's grow this garden a little bit. Cause these make good money, the green beans. That's only 42 simoleons. I think we should plant all of them because then we'll make a lot more in a bulk sale rather than He can roast a hot dog, technically, yeah, I, I think. Even though we have simple living, I think he still can. We can roast marshmallows, apparently, is our only option. Okay, water everything. Oh my god, I have not played this Rags to Riches. Like, oh my gosh. I usually can't stand to do it, because I can't stand not having, like, an aesthetically pleasing lot. But he's going to work for everything... He has water shut off day is now in effect. Oh, fantastic. Go pick these up. Do we want to sell these from inventory or does that feel like cheating? Let's see food. We got to work on food. Yeah. Oh, we could go fishing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forget about fishing as a skill sometimes. Where is the fishing spot off of this lot? Is there one? along this river somewhere. Where, actually, I've never, oh look, I didn't even realize this was over here too, this little camp spot. Um, I've never gone camping in Chestnut Ridge. Oh yeah, let's use them as fertilizer since I don't have a bee box yet. Uh, where do we go fishing? 
Why is there this entire creek but nowhere to fish? That makes absolutely no sense to me. Is there even a fishing spot here? This is so bizarre. I've like followed the whole creek. I'm like, there's not a single fishing spot in this entire world. Are you kidding me? Oh, for an expansion pack? And there's an, in a Wild West town. Can I pass it at the dock? Let me orient where I was. I went this way. Yeah, was there something? There's a dock with a pond. Is it in a different neighborhood than where I'm at? It might be the other neighborhood. Click on the water. I can't click on that water. I can't click on that one. Yeah, none of these. I think I might have to go to a different neighborhood. Yeah, it might be a different neighborhood. Wait, you saw it when, yeah. Oh, it, it is in this neighborhood? Okay, I might have to have him run around because I'm just having a hard time while I'm scrolling. Um, here, eat a carrot real quick to hold you over. And then a dock. You guys are saying it's a dock, so it's not going to be. I feel like it would be this way. This is now going to be a, oh my God, Annabelle Sweet. Well, first of all, we don't have phones, but she's thinking about us. The woman back in Strangerville is wondering. Wait, here it is. I found it. I found it. I see what you're saying. It's very tiny. I was about to say, if this world does not have a fishing spot, that is going to be mind blowing. We found it. Okay, thank you guys for your help. <laughs> that was like a scavenger hunt. Whew. Why are we very flirty all of a sudden? Yes, we caught a minnow. No, mom is not calling. Thank you for the good vibes. And then there's this too. All right, William, what have we got so far? You got a minnow. Oh my God, it's Harold. Hey, Harold. Oh my God, I love that we're out here fishing. With, well, we were fishing with Harold, but he's off. Why are we already so dirty again? Is it a heat wave? No, it's just hot. Okay, come on, catch a few things, because then I think we can roast fish on the fire. Okay, good. We caught a minnow. We got a wall wally? Is that how you say that? Wally? Wally? Oh my god, stop. I need to turn off the phone. Overheating. No, why are you overheating? You're in your hot weather, I'm pretty sure. No, you're not. Walleye, like an eye. That's how I was gonna say it the first time. Okay. Well, I guess we shouldn't catch too many because they're gonna go rotten. Then we can just use them to fertilize the garden, I guess. Here, see if you can just catch one more. Yeah, what is that? The, the the T one that I don't know how to say. Here, come look for frogs, I guess. I don't know if we're gonna do any. We'll just grab that. I don't know what we'll do if we'll sell the frogs. I don't like selling stuff from my inventory. I feel like we should introduce ourselves to people as they pass by. Yabasa. Hi, nice to meet you, Juniper. She's just one of the Chestnut Ridge townies that I gave a makeover. Got any tips on catching fish out here? Just sell the frog? Yeah, might as well. I think 
Did we get a cheap one or an expensive? Oh, we only got a tin simoleon one. How fantastic. Okay, let's head back to our lot because our horse is uncomfortable and I'm not sure what's wrong with him. Whoa, slow down, William. What's wrong with social poor hygiene low? Here, let's go. Fresh coat. Oh, he's playing? Okay. Um, well, then in that case, let's see if we can roast our fish. I saw Danny Bell in the background too, Drill Sergeant. I, I caught a glimpse of her. Oh, the church steeple in the background. I didn't even notice. I love all the, that most of the lots are all done. Okay, let's light this. We should be able to roast our fish. I was having issues with this at one point. Look at the banker. The banker's back there. Try again. Um, roast. See, I, it doesn't let me roast the fish, which is really annoying. Okay, take care of Rusty. I know, you burn your arm. We're having a rough go. Just over the tree above his shoulder. Oh, there it is! Oh my god, I do love it! Look! It's the church! Oh my god, I love that! Okay, we gotta hurry up, because uh, we need food. Pick up that poo. Why won't it let me roast my fish, though? I've had that problem before. Thank you, Annie! It's a little shorter than I, like, wanted it to come out, but it's here and it'll grow. And I, I wanted it short again, so bad. If I click roast, I only have the option for marshmallows. Is it, is it a cooking level thing? Do we need to be level two? I'll just do marshmallows for now because that's like the only option we've got. I think we might just need level level two. I know you stink. Come on, finish your marshmallows. You're too... Oh, water has been... Shut up. Hold on, we're gonna... Instant repeal. We're not doing water and power conservation. I need to fill those up with stuff like you said, Rose. Now does the water work? Here, wash yourself off in your bucket. Okay, tomorrow we should have a pretty good harvest from the garden. The horses can have babies. This whole world is like so good for like this time period. There's like, you know, there's a couple trucks and stuff like scattered around, but we just covered it with a rock. But this is, it has a good Wild West vibe. Okay, good. Our hygiene is good. I didn't miss harvest on anything, I don't think. No, I didn't. Okay, that's good. Let's try to get this cooking to level two real quick. Like think that's my theory let's see if that's stop calling us no we don't want to hang out john we're halfway across the country can you turn the delivery request things off and um i do have i have simple living on but even with that where's my inventory i feel like i've I did, had the same issue when we did the last decades challenge. Oh, turn it off and then it'll let us roast the fish. That seems so counterintuitive. That seems backwards. Seems like if we have the simple living on, then we should be able to roast the fish. It seems so backwards. Oh my God, it is true though. That's so backwards. Here, roast fish. <laughs> I am gonna use the horse poo as fertilizer. I need to go put it down on a couple of the more expensive plants. Roasting up our fish. Oh wait, hold on. I think I might want a screenshot of this potentially as our rags to riches. <laughs> My YouTube. Let me see. Get him with the fish. Living off the land. Okay. 
That D Sibs, you can roast fish with simple living on. Okay, I'll have to figure out what's causing that to happen. Because if you can, then there's something causing mine to make me not be able to. Hmm. <laughs> Ruru, what about the Sims isn't backwards for sure? Or maybe you have a mod that fixes it. That's so true. Once we start to get so many mods, it's like hard to know. It's like, is a mod making this happen? Or is a mod making this not happen? It's like so many little things. Okay, how long does it take to roast a fish, William? I thought maybe it was like cook like a cooking level thing, like only at like level two or something like that. Can you guys hear the game sounds today? I tried to turn, I know probably like the roaring of the fire is like really quiet, but oh my God, yeah, now he needs a scar from the burnt arm and he needs a scar from getting attacked by the outlaws. He doesn't want sushi, he likes it well done. Yeah, after just catching it in that lake. Oh, look, now we got like a full meal though. I need a trash can. Oh, well he can wash it in the sink. <laughs> Okay, and then just head over here to pee. I love this pee anywhere mod. It's like so good for realism. Oh, you do have a mod that fixes the campfire decims? Awesome. Okay, here, come pick this up and let's fertilize our expensive. Our more expensive ones. I do need to be mindful of the years, though, because he's going to get, like, too old to have kids, but, well, I mean, not too old to have kids, but I want to, I don't want to wait too long, but we don't have a house yet, so we're not really thinking about wives and kids yet, but I'm going to see, I think today's Wednesday, I think today's the last day, because I got to remember to keep the year updated, so it is. Oh, no, we're actually good. It is the, well, it's the third day of 1852, so tomorrow will be the last day of 1852. There he goes, being on his feet again. Okay, we're good. Let's get a full night's sleep and see how much we make from harvesting that garden tomorrow, because then we should have enough to get a um, wood, what do you call it? Woodworking table? And then he can start building that and we can start building our house. I'm also wondering if we should do some like odd jobs or something. We gotta do something else to earn some income. Waking up flirty. Oh my gosh, William. Here, just wash your hands and teeth so we can build your hygiene. Here, let's go harvest the garden first. Whiskey's fine. Okay, let's sell all that. Oh my god, okay, yes, the green beans were... Okay, we should plant more of the strawberries because those give a lot of money. Because that worked out really well. Now we're going to be making 500 from the green beans and the bell peppers make good money too. Which is, this is the most beautiful garden you've ever seen, isn't it? Okay. This is gonna solve our money problems really quickly. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. If we build a cube, then we can get the boost for skills. Let's do that. Tomorrow's gonna be a good harvest. No more gambling. <laughs> Not at least until we have a roof over our head, right? Is that my rule now? No gambling until we have a roof over our head? Literally. Okay. Let me save because it's like weirdly laggy all of a sudden. Wait. 
Whiskey's good. Let's roast up a uh, fish. Yeah, I can make an outhouse out of the cube. We'll see how much money we've got. I'm gonna have him roast a fish. I don't think that's actually using our fish in our inventory, or is it? Well, I had three fish and now I only have one. So I think it is actually using our fish. Yay, I like that. Um, how much money do we need to build a roof <laughs> over his head? We have 1,038 simoleons. We just made 500 something just from the green beans alone. And then I planted the strawberries and the green, or the bell peppers, because those make the next highest money. So that'll get us pretty good tomorrow, because then we'll have 500 from the green beans plus whatever the strawberries. Yeah, and you only pay for the walls. The mod is by Vintage Vintage Seamstress. You left a link in the mod section. Thank you, G-Sims. We'll fix that so that way we can have Simple Living on and Roast Fish. Okay, this takes so long. Oh no! Fire Marshal Quackers! We have an emergency! I need a drink, I'm nervous. Oh no, oh no. Okay, he's got the extinguish interaction. Come on, hit. William, put your fish down. Oh my God, oh my goodness, oh my God. I'm gonna have to reset him, okay. I know if William died, we'd have to just start playing. Do we do a death roll or it's like for that? Like, I feel like I want to do death rolls for ac accidents when there's not an actual in-game chance of death. But with a fire, there's an actual in-game chance of death. So I feel like I would just let it be like, okay, he survived because he got the fire out. Yeah, you definitely do have to take a moment to plan out how to extinguish the fire. And then he laughs. He is feeling playful right now. How about we go ahead? He didn't even get to finish all of his fish. His fish is gone. How about we extinguish this? I don't even know what caught on fire. Us, I think. Uh... I literally, I'm pretty sure it was like our food. It burned up into an ash pile. I know we need a trash can. Um, okay, let's go into build mode real quick and see what we can do. <laughs> Wait. He's ahead of his time, fire prank gone wrong, except he doesn't have a YouTube to put his pranks on. Oh my God, he would be a YouTuber. Okay. Got a thousand simoleons. The first thing I want to get is a woodworking table just so we can actually start. His, I think he got up to level four or five woodworking before we left the house, so that was good. Woodworking. I think it's like 750. It's either 500 or 750. I can't remember. And it's, I always think it's an outdoor activity, but it's like creative, I think. Yeah, it's 750. That's what I thought. So that's going to be our biggest investment. And a bee box for the garden. Oof, that only leaves us 288, but I got to do the one room tile just for the just for the bonus, skill bonus. How much is a bee box? A hundred and, oh, that's an insect farm. Can we afford, oof, it's 265 and we have 288, but we're about to get a bunch of money the next day. Do we think fertilizing the plants is the highest the best use of our 288 simoleons actually i don't think we can build our one the walls are 60 dollars each so even a four a one tile 
I'm just gonna hide it over here for right now and then we'll move it and make it part of our, yeah, the one square is gonna be 240. Ooh, you can do that with the more woodworking mod. You can craft bees. Ooh, that's cool. I wanna make sure we've got tiny home residential on requirements. You need at least four tiles. Well, I don't have enough money for four tiles yet. Okay, well then let's save the money on that until tomorrow. We gotta strategize. Ooh, I never play like this. It's fun to have to like actually think about it. Um, cause we'll have enough from the garden tomorrow. So let's just start there. Let's just start there. I'm not going to get the bee box yet. Or the CC bee box. How much was the CC one? Was it cheaper? Cause that's what I was trying to find. If the custom content one was less expensive. Okay, it's the same cost. It's the same cost, but if we can get these to be higher. I'm going to move everything closer to it because why are those? Let me check that we didn't have anything go into. Do you guys have your gardening stuff end up in your... Okay, no, nothing ended up in here. It ends up in inventory sometimes. Oh yeah, I like the C, I just like that CC one like a lot. Okay, some of our plants are random now. It's okay. We're gonna make this lot pretty later. Okay, just go pee real quick. Oh, I meant to get him a trash can, but it's fine. Uh... Almost every city you have, you play catches on fire at least once in their life, which is so unrealistic because I don't know a single person IRL who's caught on fire while cooking. Exactly. Um, should I, while we have a little bit of money, we could do, ah, uh, see, I shouldn't have gotten the B box because we could have really, hold on. I know technically this isn't going to, can I just. If I sell this, we're not going to get the full amount back for it. 212, it was 265. Ugh. But what I should have done was this. This makes a lot of money really fast, too. But we need to have the initial investment. And I don't care about selling from inventory on this. We're just going to sell from inventory. It will signify that we were prepping stuff to build our house. Your husband's not a great cook, but he's never set on fire. Just because you can't cook doesn't mean you're stupid. Oh God, William, I'm worried about you going. Uh, we're gonna have to keep hopping in here though to sell these. Okay. What are you making? Hot dogs? That's, let's say you're making sausage. Hurry up, because you need to get back to making woodworking. I think we're going to probably, we might be able to build like a small house tomorrow between woodworking and the garden. And then we could start looking for a wife. But no woman's going to want to marry you right now, William. Not in these living conditions. Oh. <laughs> Let's get that house built, buddy. Please tell me I selected wall hanging when I did that. Let's see, it's Thursday, so tomorrow remind me to, I gotta update the year on the screen when we get to tomorrow in the game. I, I deleted the, well I didn't, the, the um, Drill Sergeant, the base game B-Box, I hadn't, I was still in build mode, so like, we never got like fully charged for it because I had placed it and then deleted it. But that one I had placed and then gone while hanging hurry up these make really good profit margins so the wall hangings are really really good they're the best thing to do until you get to the bathtubs 
I read a whole guide on woodworking once on how to like get rich quick with woodworking. Which obviously from a realism standpoint, it's not like he um, is actually selling these to make money right now, but. So now we're back to 500. Spend money to make money. Let's go, William. Knock out as many as you can without getting burnt out, hopefully. He's lovelorn. He's lovelorn. We've got to go to the, we've got to go to the saloon tonight. He's going to be looking for a lady. Oh God. He wants to be mischievous too. Uh -huh. I do have a blacksmith mod actually. I do. I have the one that I use in my ultimate decades challenge by um, Jane Simpson, I think. Okay, let's get this knocked out. Maybe knock out two more and then we can go to the saloon and find you a woman. Look at the moon rising. Ha <laughs> Oh, I know you can't afford anything right now. Okay, we're doing pretty good though. I think how many days has he been at it? Like three days? Oh my God, Joe. No one is calling us. Joe is raising our baby for us. God bless him. Okay, do one more because we have enough and then we'll go in and sell him. This is your rags to riches strategy. If you can afford a woodworking table and you have a not high enough skill to make wall hangings, that is your claim to money. Love and only, no gambling. If he can get a sentiment with one of the saloon girls, then he doesn't have to pay. <laughs> That'll be my rule. If he can make one of them, he will be building his little cabin. Okay, he's been working on building the house all day. So we're up to 985 simoleons just from investing in woodworking. So that's pretty good. Pretty good day's effort, I'd say. Um, did I just save? I'm saving again, even if I didn't. He's a charmer. So do we go to the saloon for a little bit of fun? Because he worked really hard today. He deserves to play. <laughs> we won't gamble. I won't gamble. But we need to see who's there because maybe we can start. Um, yeah, I think tomorrow from tomorrow's harvest, depending on how much we get from that, if we're a little short, we can just very quickly do a couple more woodworkings. But I think we'll be able to build tomorrow. So I'm really happy. Never saw any other challenge just started watching a few days ago. Like you've never seen any challenge at all. I This isn't the way I normally play. I normally don't do like make myself work up this hard, but it's kind of fun because it's really rewarding when I finally do. I want to see who gets here though, because if any of the love interests come, should we ask her to dance? <laughs> so, so, huh? I mean, why can't you guys dance? Oh! <gasps> I said if we got a sentiment with any of the girls and he got a sentiment with Fannie Mae right off the, t right off the bat, but I think it, he has a sentiment towards her. I want them to have a sentiment towards us. Says they have amazing cat uh, compatibility. Yeah, William feels closer to Fannie Mae from Quality Time, which tells me William is into Fannie Mae, but so far Fannie Mae has not showed any interest in us. So she's the one that's hard to get. Compliment her outfit. He's uncomfortable from woodworking. Okay, good. He's feeling better. Her thought bubble is blank. <laughs> if I put the produce into his inventory and take it to the in-game grocery store in the town, he could sell for more money than what he does from inventory. Okay, we'll do that, Rose. And I haven't gone to that. Are we cowpoke? Oh my God. William, you're making a fool of yourself. <laughs> not cool buddy that was not she she is not interested 
Oh my god. He did not. You need a drink from that. Oh my gosh, this just says that Rusty is ready for some action from Woohoo Drive. That's from the relationship overhaul. Yeah, go to Rusty's not here, and I'm trying to figure out why. And it doesn't let me bring him here. Here, invite. Oh wait, he is here. It's just for some reason. Come here, Rusty. Come to the bar because William needs to have a drink and talk to you about that embarrassing moment we just had. Where are you going? No, we're not going to sleep. Come here. Maybe one of your potential love interests will walk in, but I don't know. I don't think you deserve to flirt with anyone after that horrifying moment. He's ready for some action from Woohoo Drive 2. It says... William is itching for some fun of the not safe for work variety. You boys, I cannot with you right now. Oh, love the idea of working hard all day, getting together with the same people you know at night to relax at the bar. Uh, simple times for sure. Uh, sincere promise, that's the coolest new follower tag you've seen so far. Oh, thank you. Boss Hog's wife will really have an affair. Let's just see what happens. Let's get some drinks in us. Hold on, is Rusty tending the bar? Yeah, he is. Okay. Order drink. Let's just get a beer. Yo, Rusty. Pour me a strong one, buddy. I'm making a fool of myself. Okay, let's see who's here. Is that Eden? Call her over. Oh god, not the banker. Where are all the saloon girls? Where are my girls at? Oh god, Sadie. Sadie Hawkins. Okay, this sim is who I initially made to be his most preferred love interest, but she's like a sad girl. Like, she's not been a vibe. <laughs> We should make a move on Sadie. Call her over. Oh god, we have to pee really bad though. My game's kind of laggy. Can we order a drink for her? Why? Oh wait, yeah. Let's see what happens. Sit down, William. Order her a drink. Oh no, it's running an ad! Oh, yeah. Wait. It said Eden when I hovered over. Oh, that's Eden Smith. Sorry, that's Brittany Sim. When they're in their bonnets, they look really similar because I think I gave Lily. Lily has similar hair when I was, um, <laughs> when they're in their bonnets, they look alike. Did we order her a drink? Where'd Rusty go? Oh, well, that didn't work very well. Because Rusty stopped hitting the bar. Order a drink for Sadie. Try again. And don't pee on yourself. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Did she accept? Look, she looks sad. She still looks so sad. Oh, yeah, bros. We do need to save because it's, like, being laggy. I don't know if it's because... I mean, we've played on this lot a lot, and it hasn't always been laggy. So, okay, we're trying again. My emotes are not working, like none of them? That's weird, I've never had that problem before. All 
Are you talking about the the channel point redemption, the save? The one that has the audio, there's two different ones. So there's this there's the one that you did, which is just in chat, and then there's a different one for more channel points that plays a sound. If that makes sense. I thought I had took took the one off, but um or if you meant the save emotes. Oh, thank you for that hydrate. I don't think I've had water this whole time. Yeah, so that one that Becca did, that's the same one. And then there's save check. <laughs> and then there's that one, yeah. Let me know if that was like really quiet for you guys, because that sound was really quiet for me. Like almost to the point where I might not have even heard it if there was a lot going on in the game. Okay, it's really quiet. I need to bring the volume up on so I'm in, I don't know what it is with Twitch, but I'm having a lot of problems with audio. Okay, I just saved like three times when you guys did it, so. Okay, come out to the bathroom. I was gonna try to see what happened with Sadie, but we're just probably gonna head, head back home. He's not gonna get any loving tonight. Unless we crash here. Are the saloon girls all upstairs sleeping? They are. They went to bed early on a Friday. It was a slow Friday night in town. Okay, I'll travel him back home and then I'll save it again when we get there and see if that helps it stop lagging. Um, and then I turned the sound alert sounds up, Rose, so hopefully... It may just be that one sound that I need to work on because I didn't create that sound. I got it straight from sound alerts for the save. So I might just make my own to rectify that because now the other ones are going to be too loud. Uh, okay, we're good. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. But I, I don't do good at trying to manage like the technical stuff in chat versus like still focusing on gameplay. Oh, no, I have it, Rose. That will work. That 100% will work. Who is this random child? That should do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There, now my camera is not lagging anymore. I don't know where you came from. Are you good? Your fun is low. Go play, Whiskey. We have to run all the way over there to ask him to play. That's really annoying. Okay, we'll deal with hygiene tomorrow. Let's just sleep. Hopefully not starve through the night. Yes, I think we're finally going to be able to build, though, and get out of the sleeping bag. Why do these look like they need to be watered? They do need to be watered. Oh, the steam change is passed. I missed it. I wasn't looking. Okay, go ahead and get up. I think the first thing he does is go to whiskey every morning. Okay, you're stinky, but come take care of the garden. So we can see where we're at money-wise. William, this is gonna be so satisfying to be able to build a house. Okay, water so these don't die. I know, you smell terrible. Okay, hurry up. And then we can make this garden, like set this garden up to actually look more intentional. Should we, okay, let's make a decision too right now on the season. Should I... Actually, I'm gonna let me update the year because now we are officially in the start of 1853. So let me change that on screen. So it is officially 1853. And should I extend the seasons out to 14 days instead of seven so we get more use out of this garden? If not, we'll have to plant a fall garden pretty soon. Uh, but let's see, we got. 653 simoleons. Really, those green beans are the main thing that are giving us money. So that's 1590. We might need to do a few more woodworkings. Um, can we 
still grill this fish. Now I'm scared to grill the fish though. There was a certain piano player in a fishing gear outfit that wasn't there anymore. He must love the fishing outfit. Here, come on and here, roast some fish, but don't catch yourself on fire this time. Rose, maybe we should have gotten a table because when he was standing next to the fire eating, we caught on fire. Oh wait, I forgot our hygiene's all the way down too. A double bed for woohoo. Okay, so let me see. Just build a four by four with a veranda that he can sleep indoors on a bed. Keep the sleeping bag in inventory. Get him a double bed for woohoo. What just happened? Is it because our hygiene is so bad that we stopped making our... Did you just waste that fish? Oh my god, he didn't even finish making it. And it wait, it used up the fish and now we have nothing to cook. William. I don't think we're going to be able to afford all that unless we do some woodworking first. Here, clean up a little bit, buddy. Oh, we're in a situation at the moment. He can just woohoo in a bush. Okay. Oh, no, he's doing veggie dogs. Oh, well, whatever. We'll take what we can get. I wish it would have been the fish, but he wasted it. Good. Yeah. You learned from last time. Good job, buddy. Come sit over here and let's not catch on fire. No, don't go sit over there. Oh my god, Annabelle Sweet is asking us on a date. <laughs> that was the saloon girl from the other oh, town. Okay. Here, go do a couple wall hangings so we can get that money to put towards our house. And we're going to build our little cabin. He can still marry and the wife will have to rough it with him and raise the kids on a hard life. That'd be not, That'd be kind of fun for Gen 1, though. Like this whole, I mean, like that is what the frontier, um, frontier would be. Okay. Knock this one out real quick. Oh my God. He's still flirty. He really wants to woohoo. So we need to build this house and then we'll get you a woman. We need to get our family started. All these people calling us. It's crazy. Looks like Annabelle's the love interest, but she doesn't live in this town. Count in. <laughs> okay. Oh, our needs are not great. Okay, we've got 1840. Okay, good. I'm just gonna plop it wherever, and then we can. You know, as we add on, we can move the lot around. Because I'm not going to make it perfect to start. Let's see. How expensive is a... Five by four. I might go back down to four by four, like you said, Rose. But I'm going to try that to start... We can add to it. Yeah, and a one by four. Do stairs cost money? They do. Dang it. I want it to raise it up, but if stairs cost money... Yeah, well, they're not that expensive, though. They're not very expensive. For right now, we'll just go up one. But then eventually, I'm going to raise, raise it up just a little bit. Um, we'll just start really cheap. Yeah, I'm getting the door right now. Oh, this is going to be so satisfying when this is actually like a full lot. Cottage living with the window. Okay. This one doesn't feel as Wild West, though. Do 
Do I have that door that I used in my... I kind of want to use this door that I used in my <laughs> Ultimate Decades Challenge. How much is it though? Oh, it's 105. I'm not paying 105 simoleons for a broken door. I really want to use, I'm going to use the one that I want to use. I want to use this one with the little window. Um, and then I was going to do like all of this stuff to look like it's like home. Maybe they're going to do that one. Oh, or maybe the, oh, that's way bigger than I thought it was. At cottage living. The other one I was thinking was the smaller one. Ooh, Sydney, I'm not good at the, like, if you're getting the exception errors, I would just go through, if you use mods, I would check, like, the mod list, like, Scarlet Rims, like, mod. <laughs> it's such an awkward, it's such an, like, awkward width. I want it to be, like, one more tile wider, but I'm not sure. That's 120 more simoleons. I, like, really want it to be one more tile wider, but now is not the time to be, like, Choosy. I have to remind myself, this is not going to be the final version of the house. Yeah, you do really see how small it is when you add a window to it. That is for sure. I'm like, it just looks so awkward. But I'm like, we're going to make it pretty one day. I want to make it like a little log cabin. Like he built a little log cabin and a thatched roof. Yeah, Rose, for sure, but it's definitely not the final version. But it's still so hard to not want to make it, like, aesthetic. Like, I still want to make it. I think I'm going to do the little moss roof. Something along these lines. We're gonna keep the overhang. Okay. And then Can I afford two more windows? I think I can. Get some light in here. As long as the fire pit is away, we should be good. Okay. We're not going to paint the ceiling right now because that would be unnecessary expense. Um... Oh, yeah, let's do that, Rose. Let's do the, um, and I, I'll put, I actually don't want to do it that way. I want to, I think I'm actually going to, I'm going to do it, um, the way I did it in my, ultimate decade. I'm trying to think of like, how did I do it? I think I did it. This is not what I did. Oh, well, I'm just going to bring this out by two and put a, oh, wait, but it's not going to let me put the column up to it, is it? Because it's going to be, I 
it's lower than the oh wait, no it does let me raise it I think I want to do that just sleep in the shack with a sleepy bag I think until we have we'll get a real bed when he has like a woman and let's put our our little sink out here okay The reason why it looks weird is because it doesn't have a uh, um, rose again. It's not the final. I don't want to stress about this right now. Um, we'll put this inside so he doesn't have to sleep under the stars anymore. But then it like looks like he's still like, you know, it's still a work in progress. Day one, he got the walls put up. We'll keep this far, far away. <laughs> need a trash can though I don't want to link that to the fire because I'm scared it will burn but we do need a bin we'll do this one I'll just put it outside for right now we have 328 left and we can still do some woodworking. So for right now, should I make him build a table and chair? I just don't, I just like to pick my own though. I always, I know they can do them on the woodworking, but I just don't love the ones that you get with the woodworking. I'd rather him have one of the horse ranch ones and then we can put a little light a little candle like a lantern let's do this little cottage garden one let's just put it right there we don't need a fireplace or anything right now because it's winter becca you love that he can pee anywhere it's like the greatest as we don't have to worry about a toilet just yet um, and I think if we just put a little candle, I do want to make, once he has a wife, I'm going to make her make all the candles. But for right now, we'll just put, we won't worry about that at the moment. But once we can, yeah, at least now he can get out of the heat. Okay. Okay. So I think, I feel like I could have him do a little bit more woodworking so that way maybe we can get something to make cooking a little bit of a better situation because cooking right now is our struggle. Here, you, you're about to have, just, here, go pee behind the house so we can get that out of the way. And then come and do a couple wall hangings. It, it's not winter for him. I'm not going to freeze any of my sins to death like I did last decade's challenge. Wait, why did this? Did I place this where he can't do this? What is It's because he's uncomfortable. Oh, my God. From woodworking, pinched finger. He beat on his roots again. He needs social. Here, come pick this stuff. Throw that away. Eat this before it spoils. We're not going to be wasteful. Come on, I need you to not be uncomfortable so you can do woodworking. His little cabin. You're making it, William. It's taken a while, but we're making progress. At least now you have a physical structure that we will expand on for sure. Here, clean that up. Follow the vibe, be my tribe. We thrive. Yeah, we'll have him go talk to Whiskey. Where is Whiskey? <laughs> Whiskey, where have you run off to? Where is our 
our beautiful horse. There he is. Oh my gosh, this man wants to woohoo so bad. Whiskey! I'm gonna have to lock my door! Oh my gosh! Lie Monster, or Lie Monster, I'm sorry, I'm not trying to say it. He doesn't have enough money to make the hanging... Oh, haha, <laughs> thank you. You're right. I wasn't even thinking, because I've just been making them the whole time. Um... Whiskey, if you wouldn't mind um, coming, coming out of the house, please. That's the first time I've ever had a house, a horse go in my house. I love you, Whiskey, but I did not build that for you. Oh, man. I was thinking about picking up odd jots from the community. Oh, Rose, I forgot to go sell the stuff at the... I totally forgot and I sold everything from inventory this morning. I forgot I was supposed to take it to the general store because I keep forgetting that that general store is there. So I need to remember that with tomorrow's um, garden inventory so we can get more money. I completely, completely forgot. Um... Whew. I feel like I need to take a quick break because I feel like my brain, it's like, I'm trying to think of stuff to do, but I'm like, ooh, we gotta take a quick break and regroup. But I, he, it's close to the end of the day. So let's get him through and then we'll start. It's your first stream watching, happy to be here. Well, welcome in. Okay, get your social up. You know what would get a social up real fast? Go and get with one of the girls at the saloon. <laughs> but I kind of don't want to travel off the lot tonight. I just want to get him to bed early and then get, get started. I could have put like a little water trough bathtub for him too, but I think that would probably have cost a lot. So we'll just keep washing. <laughs> we'll just keep washing off in the sink. Here, let's get to bed early so that we can harvest. So the garden heart, like the stuff, becomes harvestable at five thirty a.m. in the game. So let's get him to sleep early so we can wake up like right as the garden is ready. for that follow as well and brown coats united a few minutes ago as well i don't know my alerts i'm like i have a tendency sometimes when i'm getting really into gameplay i accidentally tune out my alerts and then i feel really bad um okay let's harvest everything and this time we're gonna go sell at the general store and see how much of a difference that makes water everything real quick we'll get you some food in just a second oh our lemon tree is coming up i feel like i should extend the seasons i feel like i should make it be summer for another week i saw a bug somewhere over here Hold on, which one is it? It's great for bugs. Hurry, come take care of the garden and we'll get you some food. Ultimate Decades Challenge has taught me that it takes a lot for them to starve to death. So now I'm not as worried when they're in the red. I'm like, he'll survive for 24 hours if he had to. Boy, he needs to work on living since he almost died too quickly. Okay. You're watching building a church. We built a church lot in this world as well. It's like pretty simple. I want to build like a cathedral. It would be like super challenging. Oh my God, look at what our house looks like on the map. It's like so sad. Um, where do I need to travel to to be able to go there? Does it matter if I, this will probably be close. So let's do this. And then once we sell everything, we'll take a quick break because I need to go to the bathroom. 
and my brain just needs to reset. A lot of times when I can feel myself, my brain getting tired, if I um, take like a break, as soon as I walk away, I like come up with an idea. So I think it's over here. So sell items. I've never done this before. So yeah, there's like a general store, not the one that I built, but there's like one in Chestnut Ridge. It's so cool. So it's like a rabbit hole. Um, excuse me, would it be cheating if we sold that grape nectar? I feel like it is. I don't want, I'm not going to sell it because, can I not type in the number? Do I really have to sit here and click this 50 something times? Uh, this is painful. I'm going to have to do this one 60. So it won't let me, nope, it won't let me type. Oh, I could. Okay, so if, I got you. I'll go to that one next time. That lot. I don't want to call it a reservation, though, Rose. It's just a campsite because I want to be mindful of, of how I approach that. Oh, good tip, Rose. If you hold shift, you can go up 10 at a time. I didn't know that. I'm a keyboard short, but keyboard shortcut girly. So I always love a good shortcut. Okay, that was 845 simoleons. Um, Food-wise today... Okay, let's go home and add something where he can actually cook. I do have UI cheats. Today I do. Yesterday or Tuesday I didn't, but I have it back in now that they updated it. Okay, let's add something. Okay, let me travel back to house and then let's take a break. I'm forgetting that I need to take a break so easy for me to just like keep going 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 <laughs> and never stop but when we come back we'll add some like we'll put like a a stove in it I think we can afford at least a grill at a minimum so we don't have to use that but uh use the fire anymore and then we can make more stuff with the grill that came comes with horse ranch but let's do a real quick break and then we'll all he does is pee. I know, right? And I'm not even giving him like that much alcohol right now. I could understand if he was drinking a lot, but he's not. So, okay, let's do a quick break and then we'll get back to it.
Okay, I'm back. You guys are cracking me up in the chat. He needs to see a doctor for his bladder issue. Oh, goodness. Probably. He's hungry, though. Let's get him a grill. And welcome in, Allison. No worries. No worries if you've been busy. Welcome, welcome. The horse ranch one. Oof. 880. He's got to get on some woodworking. But now we only have 42 simoleons. But we need this because food is becoming a struggle. <laughs> Good thing he can pee anywhere because um, I'm just going to put it over there for right now. Rose, you're back. Got you a salad. That sounds delicious. I'm gonna have to get me some dinner after this. Here, come grill. We'll turn, we'll um, just make some beans. We'll turn Simple Living back on in a little bit. For right now, we're on the struggle bus. But we gotta get, I'm gonna take him to the saloon. We're gonna get our needs all in order. And then we're gonna go find a wife. Cause I was like, we need a wife cause then she can start doing canning with like, Oh, actually, one of the things I want to do, though, before we go any further, is I do want to change the seasons to 14 days, though. That'll help. I typically play with 14-day seasons. I just start it with seven because um, I wanted it to be spring when we started and summer when he moved here. But I usually play with 14-day seasons. I told you to clean that up earlier. Oh, honorable. What a lovely home you've built for yourself. Oh, yeah, I know. Oh Why don't you clean that up first? Or just eat. Maybe I need to put a sink in here because he's... I think I might have put that where he can't... No, he washed his hands. He can definitely get to that. I don't know. Humble beginnings. Love this for him. Thank you, Cherry. It's so rewarding. I like... It's so hard for me during this phase because I hate it when it's like not aesthetic and it's not like laid out nice and stuff but then once it is it's so satisfying making them like work up from nothing especially like him moving to the wild west and stuff and like seeing where it goes in the later generations it'll be interesting because we start it with nothing literally nothing okay you're not gonna be get i shouldn't have fed you beans because now you're gonna be gassy i don't know what is going on with I'll give you, well, we don't have enough money, actually. I don't know. I'll just destroy these for right now because I don't know what's happening. I can't be bothered. Okay. We can, we're not going to be able to do anything super ex. Expensive. Oh. Get a little bit more money in our pockets real quick. We're level seven handiness, though. That's definitely sufficient to uh, build ourselves a house. Oh my god, now he's farting! Oh my gosh. I fed him the wrong thing to be going out to look for a wife. Oh, it's only noon? Okay. Let's build up our funds a little bit. Just keep working our way up with woodworking. We'll let the we'll let his gas pass. Do a little woodworking, get some work done. Look, he gets to work out in the shade now. Oh, whiskey, you're such a good horse. Before we go to the saloon, can you click on a community board and do an odd job with whiskey? Wait, that's another new thing for this world. Um, you can do like odd jobs with your horse. Let's see, how much do we have? Okay, 
We're working our way up to be able to do the wall hangings again. He's a technophobe! <laughs> well, that makes sense since we don't really have technology. Yeah, to build up the relationship and it'll get whiskey skills up too. I'm definitely down to check that out because I, I haven't played in Chestnut Ridge yet. So I'm learning all kinds of stuff. Okay, I'll do one more woodworking and then I'll go check out the community board thing. Okay, now we can do a wall hanging. So let's just do one of those real quick. And then this man needs to, he, he needs woohoo. Um, did Stella move here? Because I very much have my worlds locked. Are we going to find out about the baby a lot sooner than we originally thought? Send her away. Okay, tell me now, should I just send her away because she's not supposed to be here? It says she's our neighbor, though. Be gone, devil woman. She's after child support. I've playtested so much and we've already played and I have yet to have a sim show up out of the world that they're supposed to be in. And she is literally on our doorstep right now. Okay, I'm going to let him finish his woodworking. Yeah, she would have, well, I mean, she could have took a train. She definitely could have took a train to get here, but she wouldn't know where we were. Should I just send her home? I sent her home. I'm not ready to, I'm not ready for that, but that was interesting. That was very interesting. Oh man. She even got through the mods to get here. I wonder why it said she was our neighbor. That's, I'm like, I really almost want to check the world map, but. She ran into his mother who told her how he is faring. He, I was thinking he would have sent his mom a letter too. I was wondering about that too. That's so weird. Okay, Rose, where do I go for the community board thing? I have a community board set placed down at the like Sheriff Bank, but is there like a specific place in town that I'm supposed to go? Because I do want to check out those odd jobs with whiskey. Or is it something that I just do from like our phone? Or oh, you said no, you said specifically click click on community board. Oh, there should be one around here. Uh no, no Vignax. Welcome in. I'm sorry if I didn't say that correctly. Welcome in. Um, it's down the road. Okay, hallucinogen, it's down the road from that house. Awesome. Hi, welcome in. Anya is fine. Awesome. Will do. Oh my god, this girl's out of her town too. They're all coming. Oh no, that's Shania. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I thought that was um the girl from the other town. Okay, I'm looking for a community board. I feel like it would be that direction. Let's say thank you, Kodo. Where is where are we? We're here, okay. Let's let's just get on whiskey and go have a look around as Stella rides off into the sunset. Yeah, Annabelle. I was like, what's her name again? I thought that was Annabelle from a distance because she has the red dress on as well. Whew. Okay, let's do some riding. Okay, let's go find us uh let's go find us some jobs and uh let's see Jana welcome in thank you for the follow look at oh that's cool running the sound of the water when they were through where I don't, he's wearing an outfit that I did not give him I feel like there would be one oh I see it 
just trot over there. Everything's in this area. I figured it would be kind of close to where the... Um, we're just out enjoying the Wild West. Can you guys hear the sounds at all? Because the horse hooves are really, like... I like the sound of the horses. But it looks like it's real quiet coming through. I don't know how to make it louder without it being crazy in my ears. Okay, so we would do community jobs. Awesome! Call neighbors for your cargo. Give horse riding lessons for adults. Guided afternoon trail ride sounds fun. Let's do that one. So what do we do? Oh, William. Whiskey was like, no. <laughs> where is he going to the, where are we going for the community job? It says we're going to it. I'm not cheating money. Oh, we just go to a rabbit hole? Um, that's cool. Okay, it's a rabbit hole. Yeah, I just I just saw your thing, hallucinogen. So, okay, so he's going there. Why are we uncomfortable? Oh, because we were bucked off the horse. Oh, William. Oh, goodness. Okay, let me three speed so we can get back to it soon. But that's good that it builds his relationship because obviously we need that getting fucked off and all. Oh, but it's getting late. We need to go to the... Ugh. Hold on, we gotta go get ready to... I mean, it's a Saturday night. We can stay out late. Here, get on so we can ride home quicker. Okay. Where is our home? Because I don't have a click to just go home button. I need to learn the orientation of this town. Okay, over here. And we gotta go clean up so we can go out. A hard day of work. Yay, we like horse riding. That's good. That's good. That'll build fun now. At least we don't hate it. That would suck. I know he's tired. I'm willing to cheat his sleepiness, though. Just because we need to crack on. We're, we're not going to have any kids in this decade if we don't hurry up. Okay. Aw, oh, man. Our food spoiled. But come wash up real quick. Everything else we can take care of at the... Oh, where are you going? Okay, it's gonna be oh no <laughs> we got a hole in our bucket okay everything we'll just pee right here and then we can do everything else at the saloon food and social okay let's go it's getting late it's 11 p.m oh yeah i can check his satisfaction points i never really use those very much because they just don't feel like it, I don't know, it's like a gameplay element. That's not something that I usually use. But in this case, we could do it if he does have some reward points. I will double check. But I like cheating because I just want it to go up a little bit. Like if I get like a sleep solver, it'll go all the way up. And I don't want it to necessarily go all the way up. Or we can sleep in one of the saloon beds for an hour or two. I like that idea and then no cheating at all. Okay, Rusty, let me fix Rusty real quick. We'll get us some food first and that'll give some Sims time to get here. I don't know why this one hasn't been letting us order food. 
Is it that's because of the kind of bar that it is? It only lets us order chips. I'm wondering if it's the bar. Because the one in Brindleton Bay let us order food. But it's okay, we'll get free chips. That made our hunger go pretty much all the way up. And then we need some women. We need love interests. We'll just talk to Shania for right now, I suppose. She'll just hear them say. Did you hear him say yeehaw? You heard it, Rose. I'm so glad. It was like so good. <laughs> We're gonna offer Shania a rose. She's a nice girl. We could marry her because I want to run a saloon one day. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh! She liked that. She's the nice one! Oh my god, it says we can have the first kiss with her. Do we, do we go down this path with her? What is on the floor? It's dust. It's all messed up because of um, this place needs to be cleaned. I'm going to just temporarily, I'll turn it back on once we have a wife. Let's just turn off Bust the Dust for the time being. Just for now. Um, we need a nap. I don't want to have their first kiss, like, right here. I need to add them to a group. Oh, no, Rusty, you need to clean this, buddy. This is gross. This place is disgusting. Rusty, what kind of establishment are you running? Okay, hold on. I gotta focus. Oh, wait. We're talking to... Where is she? It says we're talking to Lily now, and she is a love interest, but I don't see her. How are we talking to her? She Maybe she's, like, coming over. Okay, anyways. Uh, Let's keep getting to know Shania. But they're going to end up getting awkward interaction because everyone... <laughs> I like Bust the Dust on when I'm... Once the family is together and then I have them sweep. But I think he has to have a relationship with the preacher before he will allow them to marry him to anyone. Unless it's a shotgun wedding. Oh, I haven't put anything in... Speaking of, Rose. <laughs> here he is. Our preacher. Um, I like that idea because I feel like I haven't really built, I'm kind of building the rules out as I go. And because I did the thing with the relationship with the banker, I, I like, I feel like a lot of rules don't put relationship requirements in. And I really like that being part of my challenge. So I like that we have to, just like in real life, you have to like meet with the preacher and like, okay, it does say awkward encounter now. It's because there's so many people in the conversation. What was the point of making so many love interests if none of them are going to come hang? I guess they just don't hang out at the saloon anymore. Here, come sit here. We're going to have to get a nap before we continue. We have to rent a room. Oh, when I switched it just to Shania, it's a suggestive conversation. I really like Tallulah, too. I wouldn't mind us marrying her. It would be fun to marry one of the saloon girls because then 
We could run a saloon. Tallulah, you made it awkward. We're trying. We're having flirty conversation with Shania. Ah, Benarla. Is she gonna let us know we can go up and have a nap in her room? <laughs> then it opens it up for Annabelle to work in the saloon. Cause what we could do is make it a live-in bar and our lot is big enough. So maybe it's like, this is the downtown saloon and maybe we create a saloon like out in the other neighborhood. Maybe that's what we could do. And then we can just run it. And like Rusty wouldn't even see it as competition necessarily. It would, or I don't know, maybe he does. Maybe we start to, we gotta get a nap. I like the idea that we're just gonna have a nap here. I'm gonna say Shania said we can go have a nap upstairs in her room. Cause she's a nice girl. We're not hooking up with her, but we'll just stay on this lot. It must be Fannie Mae's night off. She's already in bed, bless her. I need more activity with her though. I should probably make him just get in the bed though because that'll build sleep better. Um, and then let me save. Good call, Ruru. But that could be fun to run a saloon. Cause I am doing the live-in bar in my ultimate decades challenge, but having it be like an actual saloon could be really interesting. And now the clock's not gonna go that fast. We're just gonna have him sleep just a little bit just to get out of the red and then we'll get back up and get back to it. Oh my God, it's gonna be 5 a.m. though. Oh well, we're on mission, find a wife. Things could still work out with Sadie. I kind of wanted to see how things go with Tallulah though. I really want to see what, uh, William and Tallulah's babies would look like. I feel like they would be beautiful. I would be down for that. Samantha, welcome in. Thank you for that follow. Okay, that's good enough for now. Go ahead, put your clothes back on before we go back downstairs. Yeah, Sadie's too depressing. She really is, she's like sad girl all the time. Okay, let's go. Now it's the morning. Maybe we'll get a, have a different crowd down here. Oh no, it's prank day. I'm gonna end that because I need to fix the calendar. Okay, any other new single females? <laughs> no one other than Nanny Bell. Man, why are these girls always together? I'm putting, here, call over to Lula. This was not the direction I originally planned, but now I am interested in this. Where's she running off to? Oh God. Speaking of, I told you guys, I had a feeling. Caught in a love triangle. Finally, she's happy. <laughs> oh my God, now all the love interests are here. <laughs> I was like, we need a wife. Here we go, pick one. <laughs> Okie dokie. Well, let's just. <laughs> the women are like, hey, we heard you need a wife. Yeah, Sadie, you're already complaining. Here, come. Or no, come sit here. Dang it, Tallulah. I swear to God, I'm about to put you in a group. Let's get to know you. Let's see if she shows any interest in us. I like how he had a money symbol as soon as she sat down. Which one does he have a good sentiment with? I'm not sure. Let's see. Shania, he got a sentiment. Opposites attract good compatibility. It says they're lovebirds. We know she's romantic, but I, I can't remember what her other traits were. But William's sentiment says opposites attract. William has, oh, 
William has romantic feelings for Shania, even though they are very different. Oh, that's so sweet. I like to follow their whims, though. And he likes Shania, but I think she went up to bed. Did she? Oh, she's not in her room. I don't know where she went, to be quite honest. She must have left a lot. Oh, we're super tired again. I might have to, now that it's daytime, I'll see if we can afford a, a sleep potion. Oh, we have like 5,000 reward points already. Uh, where do I find that one? Not energized. Sleep replacement. Let's have that so we can keep going and not cheat. Ooh, <laughs> <laughs> but we're saying Shania's family like passed away and Rusty took her in and that could be fun because I was going to put Mark Twain in as her brother because Mark Twain started writing his books like in a couple decades he would be like 18 years old right now um, Mark Twain would be here drink your sleep replacement before we pass out and Froggy Zebra Hurry up, we need to work on getting a wife. Let's go. <laughs> oh no, we're sick. I have a rule. Wait, no, it doesn't say we're sick. He was just coughing. Well, drink this before we get sick. Because I have rules for if they get sick. You like Sadie, you relate to Sad Girl? Aww. Drink your sleep replacement. What is happening? Here we go. Okay, good. Now we're good on that front. We need to find Shania, his love. She's not here though. Lula's sleeping. Fannie Mae's gone too. Let me look in. I can't hover over her. I don't know where she went. Should we like go somewhere with her? Just like travel with her? We could take her out. What is the relationship with Lily? We haven't really gotten a chance to talk to her very much. So since she's here, let's get to know her and see kind of how they hit it off. And I don't know her traits, so getting to know her will be fun because I don't... This lot is glitching right now. There's Fanny Mae! Okay, don't sit across from each other, you weirdos. Okay, they got a sentiment, too. William's getting sentiments to all of them. She's a loyal sim. Okay, let's keep getting to know her, because I want to know what her traits are. Newbeam Shorg. Zopi. The Bolt. Sick of flesh. Here, tell her a funny story. <laughs> See if we can get to, can't get to know again yet. Um, we'll see if she likes our humor. Okay, well, no one else is in the conversation. We'll flirt and see what happens. Yeah, loyal is kind of like jealousy. I know Steven's here! I'm gonna control Steven and make him go play the piano while we're here. What? Oh no! Okay, we are sick. He's okay. William is hot, like super hot, and not in a good. Okay, I have a rule for this, so we've got to go. We've got to go home. We have to put a pause on because William could die, and I want to follow this one. 
So his wife is going to have to, because if he was like feverish, he would not stay out. We're not going to take Tulula home with us. Okay, I've got to see if I can make this go away, but it's going to be really hard because we don't, well, I guess we have a sleeping bag. There's a way that you can make the sickness go away on its own. And if I can't get the mood lit, then we have to do a death roll. <laughs> okay, get water and take a nap. Napping and water will give you the mood lit if I can do it fast enough. And then we should be fine. I did this a lot in Ultimate Decades. Okay, get rid of this. Okay, what the heck? Okay, hurry up, take a nap, drink your water and have a nap. Okay, his cup is stuck to his hand now. Okay, sleep it off. And then we gotta get the, the mood lit. Once he wakes up from the nap, we should get it. Uh... You've been on vacation, so you missed the beginning of the challenge. We're on the third day. So the uh, the replays are on both Twitch. Oh, Yay, we got it. Combating a cold from home remedy hydration. Sometimes simple home remedies are the best medicine. You did it, William. You did it. We're not going to die. Yay. So it's not that hard, but it's like, it's got to be kind of a like, we got to drop everything and like not die. Um, yeah, YouTube, Twitch, and Discord for the videos for sure. They're linked in Discord and then on, you can watch them on Twitch. Or, okay, we're hungry. Let's go ahead and have baked potato. Our mom keeps calling us. Oh my God, that cup is going to be stuck to his hand. I think if I reset him, it'll go away. Yeah, there we go. Okay, resume baked potatoes. And then you need to clean yourself. Whew. Oh, I need to create a command for where to, where to, yeah, shout out where to uh, catch it. I should do that. I'll make that for next, um, next stream i have like one that just like links to my youtube and stuff specifically but not one that like speaks directly to this challenge i have such a long to-do list rose it's overwhelming i'm like so busy with work that it, it, it's really sad because it's like i want to put all my time into content creation but i'm so busy with work that it's like physically painful to have to like put my own goals on hold to have to do work, but hopefully I'll be part-time soon enough. There's so much I want to put into content. <laughs> Drill Sergeant Quackers, thank you. Are we cleaning this? I didn't even realize we were cleaning this. Okay, wash that, then wash yourself. Man, he's in a cleaning mood right now. He just did all that autonomously. Now clean yourself. We need to get him a bathtub pretty soon. Okay. Oh wait, did we? Oh, we were off the lot, so we missed our harvest. Okay, I have to remember not to be off the lot at 5.30 because we'll miss our garden harvest and that's like a lot of money that we need. But if you're not home, then I'll check, I'll double check our Household inventory, but I think we just straight up missed it. Um, let's double check. Oh, Rose, I have to reach out a little. You guys are here to help. Well, that means a lot. I feel bad. I never want to ask, like, you guys to have to do a bunch of stuff. Because you guys, I just want you guys to enjoy the content. Not put you guys to work. But I appreciate you guys wanting to help. Anna's kitty, walk, or kitties, welcome in. Okay. Needs are good. Money, we have 500. I want to get back to working on a wife. Why is Sadie's dad here? 
we don't have time to talk to Sadie's dad. Going back to the sal saloon. Becca, you would kill the world. What do you mean? Is everyone here? If you helped. Whew. I don't want to end without a solid love interest. Ooh, Shania's in there all alone. Do we still have the first kiss? Because he likes her. Rusty's coming in and it's chaperone. Oh my god, Rusty totally is eavesdropping. Because he looks out for her. You are not walking off to go talk. Oh, she's flirting with us now. They're actually kind of cute, though. I'm just going to let William have what William wants if things work out with them. I'm trying to read them. Becca, if you helped with Sims, uh, you, you would ruin everything. Burn it to the ground. I think he got the off. Wait, we already had the opposites attracted. Hold on, let me see if she got a move. They both got opposites attracted, so they're both attracted to each other. They both have romantic feelings for each other. We should, like, ask her on an official date. <laughs> Tallulah, get your butt in here, girl. You're missing your chance. William doesn't know what he wants. He only thinks with one part of himself. <laughs> and it is in the brain. Okay, our needs are good. It is cute that they like each other, though, even though she's not necessarily, like, the first one I would have picked. But she's the sweet one. I like to watch what they do autonomously. Wait, is she? Oh, I forgot she's non-committal, though, because I made them... I made them non-committal to be the saloon girl, so I could change that if things worked out, but their pink bar is going up quite a lot. I mean, she's not acting very non-committal. Becca, she's been your fave since the beginning. She is really sweet. She's so sweet. I feel like she's bringing out a sweeter side of William that we haven't really seen. They keep getting the opposites attractive thing. Now they're gossiping? Steamy exchange. I don't want to... Oh my god! That was adorable! He kissed her on the cheek? Oh, she's hungry. Hold on, I'm just going to cheat her needs. We should take her on a date, or ask her on a date. But the only place I put down to like, I didn't really put down like a date place. We could take her, oh, but it makes you actually have to pick a lot, right? Like when you do a date. Hmm. We could just like make it not an in-game date. We could just like, um, do our own date and like go f out fishing or something. Then he can take her back to his sleeping bag. <laughs> oh, that made me laugh. Yeah, we don't have much to offer yet, do we? Yeah, we can go on a picnic or just go fishing. We can cook, cook something up because I don't want them to have their first kiss here. Okay, it's 542. Should we say we asked her if she wants to head out somewhere? Let's take her somewhere right now before it gets too dark. Let's go. I have an 
explored this world a whole lot. So I know there's like that little fishing spot by our place. We're gonna just go like out by the, there's like that whole like little community area. We'll just take her out there just so they can get out of the saloon for a, a little bit. Oh yeah, we should add a horse to the saloon. And then they can go riding. That would be really cute. Okay, I'll have that set up. We'll have that for tomorrow. We can, If I don't have time to do it before, we can just add him a horse on stream. Let's go. I can't, I'm so disoriented in our town, like where that little common area is over here. There was like a little camp area near us. Over here, yeah, let's go, let's come hang out over here. Is she not in a group with us? She should be. Okay, yeah, they're gonna come. Are potatoes still good? hours. Okay, we'll bring those with us. Oh, we can have some wine. Hold on. Let me have him do something real quick. I think this should work. Come pour two servings. Oh, it's going to get dark. Not Stella. Can we not pour two servings right here? Is it because of the candle? Ah, I guess we can't. Dang it, I was gonna try to get them wine, but it's fine. I don't want it, I want them to see sunset together. Where are you going? Does she not have shoes on? I have a tendency to do that when they have long dresses on. Well, they kind of miss sunset, but it's okay. Dang, she acting like she don't want to be here. Oh, sorry about spinning the camera so fast. I usually try to warn you guys, sorry. Okay, let me catch up on chat because I was not looking. Um, Rusty's gonna throw darts into Willie's body if he doesn't behave. Okay. Stella, please, please stop calling. There are no phones in this time. I know, right? Okay, let me just get them talking so she'll stop running off. Oh, he was already on it. He complimented her appearance on his own. He didn't need me. Um, Shania. Let's see, how's this gonna go? Okay, you guys just keep flirting back and forth. Dag dag. Funky boo. See why? Cobbler. Yes, enough. Am soon, Bafatamoy. Yashona. Tamid Tavar. Shunavi. He wants to give her a massage. Okay, well, you guys sit together then. <laughs> I have not seen this side of him. He wants to give her a massage. I don't know that we can actually do that right now. That's not an option for you, buddy. Yeah, they definitely need a higher friendship for sure. Because right now it's lust. It's definitely more of a lust. They can kiss in the moonlight. This girl does not like to sit down. I don't know what he's saying, but he's talking very, like, smooth. I did choose make a move, but it didn't work. I hate the first kiss animation. <laughs> it always looks so uncomfortable. Wait, that must have changed to kiss, kiss her, because it... Oh my god, y'all are cute. He confessed his attraction, now she's like, alright, I gotta get back. <laughs> alright, well we have a love interest. 
Hopefully other Sims are behaving and not having romances that aren't planned with other people. They shouldn't be because I made everybody a plate household. So it they should be fine. Okay, our needs are still honestly super good. I'm not going to lie. We're going to head back to the saloon after that. I do want it, Ruru. I want the more kisses mod. I just recently found out about that one. Um, I had start a career pin. I need to unpin that one. I'm still going to come back to the saloon. Shania still might be here, but it's early on a Saturday night. Or I think it's a Sunday night now, actually. I think it's actually Sunday. Whoops. We, we didn't go to church today. <laughs> um, but I need... Oh, I didn't know I... I didn't mean to pin this one. That was be mischievous. I didn't mean to pin that. This was start a new career. I'm going to unpin that too. But our needs are like super great. Can we gamble now? Am I allowed to gamble now? We have 572 simoleons in the bankers here. Oh, nope. The banker just left. Just kidding. Oh man, I didn't realize Steven was still in my control. Ten bar. I can gamble now! Yay! We just need more people to show up. It's 9 p.m. and no one's here. We should gamble with, with Fanny Mae. Hold on, let's play a game with just Fanny Mae. Mibs? <laughs> she hasn't had enough screen time for my liking. Ban from gambling, no! <laughs> it's a quiet night. I love that it's actually not busy right now because it's a Sunday, so that feels like the facts check out. I wish they could talk while they gamble, though, so we could, like, build relationship while we play. Uh, huh. If she beats us, I swear to God... <laughs> I don't think we'll win as much with less people playing, though. She was hiding her cards. Hmm. I know, I saw Steven. I wish I could like have him playing piano at all times. Yes. Okay, come on. Did you just win? She won. She beat us. <laughs> William, you haven't won a game since you came to this town. Oh, gosh. Just go get a drink. You suck at gambling, William. We won, like, three times in Brindleton Bay. I'm, it's losing. It's like, uh, I'm, I'm not as addicted to it anymore because now we just keep losing. Where are all the women in this town? She's learned a thing or two from watching the men play all the time, for sure. A Fanny Mae's a badass. It doesn't surprise me that she won, to be quite honest. I love that for her. Not the Hoopers here on a Sunday night. Okay, now Lily's here, so we can see if we get along with her. So we can see how we get on. I want to know more of her traits. Did it tell us because I three speed it too fast? No, it didn't. Okay. Get to know. His, his friends were really bad players. Yeah, I think so. You never ended up having a chance to make someone, maybe with someone for next gen for your game? That would be awesome. Yeah, we're going to need plenty of sims throughout the series. And I'm, I just ran out of lots to put people down. Let's get to know her. What was her trait? Okay, so she's creative and loyal, and then whatever her last trait is, we'll figure out. He's gonna brag about handiness. I've been building my own house from the ground up. He's like bragging about it. Ooh, their voices are getting so loud. It's hard to hear myself think. 
blah, 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 blah. Let's see if she she's flirty. See if she likes us goofing around. Gelbador. Luna. Ina Plea Bar. <laughs> okay, I can see a good friendship starting between these two, though. Because they have the highest friendship out of everyone else. <laughs> Let's see. Rishi Penzo. Niblets of Brescia. Lazel Pelka. Oh my god, is this the sheriff? <laughs> I love that everyone's staying out of our conversation though. But we've done a couple flirts and their pink bar has not gone up at all. And they're both flirty and the pink bar still didn't go up. So I feel like there's less of a romantic... I think there's less of a romantic relationship between them. Oh look, Nanny Bell's right here. I could see Lily maybe being like besties with our wife. Like if we married Shania, I can see her and like Lily getting along. I don't know. William's like, if this is giving me more like friend vibes. Because they're flirty, but it's like not like we've seen him with every other woman. This is, she reminds me of Evelyn. She kind of reminds me of Evelyn. What can we do? I wonder if we did something really risque, like a sexy pose. But then I feel like I'm having to force it. Oh my god, he did not just do his muscles. Okay, they have a little bit of a pink bar now. But they're not autonomously- yeah, she's leaving. She's just leaving. I wonder what it says in social panel as far as like, so I, they must just be neutral or we don't know enough because it's not saying bad compatibility, but it's not saying good compatibility either. She did not enjoy the gun show. No, she did not. She was like, yeah, okay. I was enjoying chatting with you. You seem like a really nice guy, but you just took it a little too far. Not interested. Not interested. Okay, let's go use the bathroom in an actual outhouse now instead of just peeing on our boots outside okay so should i add one or two new love interests before tomorrow just to see if there's someone better but it's like we can see how he gets along with Tulula. is she sleeping Okay, it's really late, so she's sleeping. Yeah, add a couple more, and then we can try that out. So for right now, God, his energy's still good. We'll add a couple more, see if he like really hits it off strong with someone. And then we'll keep working on the house. Let's travel back home just so we can end on the home lot. And I was actually wondering about the time too, because right now, here, let me let this load in while I'm looking it up. Make sure we're not traveling with anyone. I'm just probably gonna keep Rusty like in our control panel for the whole time, because we're gonna go to the saloon a lot and that way I can have him tend the bar. But anyways, that's the side note. Let me see, spreadsheet, calendar. What is today, Monday? It's the last day of 1853. So we'll be starting, actually, it's only Monday at 1 a.m. So it's the, we still have to play through the whole last day of 1853, but we need to get going. Four Sims days starting from rags to riches goes by really fast. But that makes it feel more like a challenge. Um, I know I'm gonna have to deselect Steven too. Let me do that from, where is he? Do we not know him? Or do I just not? I don't think we've met him yet. So I'm gonna have to, I'll just remove him before next time. But look at the progress we made. Okay, weather's really bad and it's the middle of the night. So it's kind of hard to see. I'll go into build mode so I can change the lighting. Well, I can't change it that much. But look, we made some progress. I know it's hard to see. We've got a very um, random garden, but we've got the first of a structure, even though it looks weird. Um, thank the watcher you've made a shelter. 
So we're getting there. We're getting there. We'll definitely get more money. Um, tomorrow, we the goal will be um, to have a wife. I don't think I'm going to do any like big wedding for this first generation. So once we're ready to get married, I think we're going to do something really small. I like the idea you had, Rose, though, of like having... I think they would still get married at the church, but we're not going to do a My Wedding Stories wedding. It would still just be like a, um, a wedding arch wedding and make, make it really quick. Um... But I kind of like the idea of having to like have a relationship with the pastor to get married, depending on who he decides to marry. So we'll see. I'll add a couple love interests too. And if I'm not able to make them because my workday is too busy tomorrow, then maybe we'll start stream by making just a couple of quick new love interests for him. And then we'll get into gameplay. So we might do that tomorrow too, just to give him a couple of more options. But whew. Thank you guys for sticking it out for Rags to Riches because it is a tough one. But we are making progress. Oh, yeah, D Sims is Sim in the gallery. Are you talking about the 1930s one um, to add, the one from the 1930s? I just have to figure out because the way – oh, Koto, thank you for the save. We'll save before we end. Goodbye. I'm out a lot. And the way that I have it set up, people will only populate in the world if they're assigned to this world. I guess I could still place them somewhere else and then assign them to this world. I'll figure that out. Anyways, that's for me to figure out. But anyways, um, yeah, we'll get some more Sims in tomorrow and we'll just pick right back up where we left off. So you guys have a good night and I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night, everyone.